A, ang ating paligid ay uh, maraming foreigners, no? Japanese, Korean, Chinese, who are engaged in the retail trade business. No? Meron silang restaurant, sari-sari store, grocery store, etc. And uh, this is a clear violation of our anti-dami law. Because ang foreigner, although allowed to do business in the Philippines, is supposed to be engaging only in industrial or wholesale businesses, but never retail businesses. But uh, because of the entrance of digital technology dito, dito sa atin, mundo, eh, nagkakaroon na ng uh, circumvention yung ating anti-dami law at nagbebenta sila directly in the internet. So, uh, under our Foreign uh, Investments Act, eh, ito ay binibigyan, no? binibigyan ng leniency ang ating foreigners to engage in uh, retail trade business uh, provided that there is a registration to be made by these foreigners uh, doon sa ating Department of Trade. Of course, this is for the protect, protection of the buyers uh, in the Philippines. So, medyo niliwagan yung anti-dami law and uh, even the registration of corporations, registrations of partnerships, registrations of sole proprietors are now being allowed under this liberalization of the anti-dami law and the attraction of foreign investors in the Philippines.